Hello everyone, it's Brett here, Lionheart84, and we're just having a very quick look as I'm moving some plants out today to do some spraying for uh, spider mites. Thought we'd have a quick look at my tiny little uh, Myers lemon. It's not a dwarf plant, it's just a very small young plant, a rooted, um, rooted cutting that I got a year or so back. Um, <clears throat> but it's it's lost most of its leaves in the kitchen over winter which is nothing unusual in the dry atmosphere and it has had some spider mites on it which I've uh, dealt with but um, it has flowered sporadically through the winter despite or despite its small size and as you can see it's got another, another flush of flowers coming out now you could take these flowers off but to be honest uh, it doesn't really matter because it's not going to set it's not going to set fruit at this size the plant so uh, and I normally find that a flush of flowers is followed by a flush of leaves and growth so I like to because it gets the hormones flowing th and sap flowing through the plant so I'm normally inclined to leave the flowers on in the hope that it'll boost the uh, it'll boost growth of new foliage after the flowers are finished um, and it's nice to have a bit of colour and scent in the uh, in the kitchen at this time of the year anyway so i just thought i'd uh, take the opportunity to do a quick update video on that that's a uh, very small myers lemon that i've got for anyone that's in the that's interested um please give the video a thumbs up and obviously share it with anyone you think might be interested please uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already and obviously click the bell if you'd like to be updated as new videos come out which will include of course updates on the progress of my citrus including this Myers lemon. I'll catch up with you all soon. Brett out for now.